Sioux Falls hangs on to beat Chicago. Roscombe comes through for the dogs. And Cleburne shuts out the Red Hawks. Welcome to the American Association with Brown on this Sunday. Hope you all are having a wonderful 4th of July holiday weekend. We got a great Saturday night in the association last night. Weekend series rolling on. Let's start in Milwaukee. Game two between the Dock Hounds and Milkmen. one nothing Milwaukee in the first. Roy Morales tacks on another one. An RBI double just sneaking down that line in right. And we go to the fourth where the Milkman would put it out of reach early. This is a nine-run inning for the Milkman. Cam Redding with a three-run shot kicking it off here. Redding would have five RBIs in the inning as Milwaukee wins 12-5. to To Kane County, another matchup between the Railcats and Cougars. In the bottom of the first, J.D. Osborne rips this RBI double, putting Kane County on the board. The Cougars score three in the frame, and that was all C.J. Eldred needed. Seven innings, one earned run, five strikeouts. Kane County wins six to one. To Kansas City, game two between the Gold Eyes and Monarchs. Three to two, Winnipeg in the fourth. Dason Cruz tacks on an RBI single for Cruz. We go to the ninth, five to two, Winnipeg. Trey Holmes puts it out of reach. A three-run shot out to the home run patio. The Gold Eyes, even the series, winning eight to three. To Chicago, game two between the Canaries and Dogs. Chicago took the opener, but Sioux Falls stormed ahead early in this one. Darnell Sweeney with a solo shot here in the top of the fourth. We'll fast forward to the eighth, though. Chicago would rally down six to two. Josh Altman goes deep out to left. His 11th on the season, bringing the dogs within two. They get within one, but Charlie Hasty strikes out Ryan Lidge to end the game. Sioux Falls wins 6-5. to five. To Lincoln, game two between the Explorers and Salt Dogs. Always a good matchup between these rivals. 2-2 two to two in the sixth. Yano Perez puts Lincoln ahead. A solo shot out to right. We go to the eighth where it was an eventful inning. Sioux City ties it up here. Miguel Sierra with an RBI trip all the way to the wall in right. Down four to three now. Luke Roscom brings home three for Lincoln. A bases clearing double in the eighth. Lincoln takes it by that six to four final. Finally to Cleburne. Game five between the Red Hawks and Railroaders. Bases loaded for Cleburne in the first. Hill Alexander skies one to center. A sacrifice fly brings home what would be the only run scored between these two powerful offenses loaded with stars. Tyler Perry shuts down the Red Hawks. Seven innings, three hits, five strikeouts as Cleburne takes it one to nothing. Here's your final scores from Saturday night. Cleburne goes up three games to two over Fargo-Moorhead in that six-game set. Lincoln and Milwaukee go up two games to nothing, and all three other series are even at a game apiece. Today, we've got baseball all day long for you on this Sunday. It'll start in the daytime around that 1 o'clock window with three first pitches, an afternoon first pitch in Chicago, and a couple of evening starts around that 6 p.m. window as well. And once again, make sure to tune in tomorrow at 2 p.m. Central Time on the American Association's Facebook Live and YouTube pages. I will be at Franklin Field revealing the All-Star starters and reserves in the East and West Division for the All-Star game taking place at Franklin Field on Tuesday, July 18th. Make sure to tune in tomorrow at 2 p.m. Central. You can catch all the games throughout the day today at aabaseball.tv or get your tickets through the AA Baseball app or at aabaseball.com. I'm Matt Yazel for the American Association, where we play to win.